As we begin a week, we often talk about things that make a human being successful. Well, I believe that God makes you successful, but I also believe that it's what you bring to the table that helps God make you successful. And one of the most important things that is often overlooked is good humor. I love to surround myself with people that have good humor. It can laugh often. Laugh, uh, laughing is a defense mechanism to, to the hardness of life. It makes the day easier. And when you are good humored, well, <laughs> everything changes. It just will cause every day to become better. When you think about the qualities that you most admire and appreciate in others, I bet that you like to be around people with a good sense of humor, who can chuckle at life's idiosyncrasies. You enjoy people that are considerate of others, who express a happy spirit and are pleasant and comfortable to be with. You admire people that are even-tempered in when they're facing some particular challenge. They can do it with a smile and good humor because they know they're not alone, that God is with them and helping them. Well, you can become this type of person that you most admire. You can develop in yourself qualities that you prize in others. I decree in Jesus Christ's name that you are good-humored, even-tempered, and pleasant all through this day. This is not only a positive affirmation, it is also a goal. You can strive to be a good friend to others, to follow the golden rule, to be a life ambassador. And there are many opportunities throughout the day to practice your new skills, and you're ready to be the person that you've always wanted to be, to express your inner Christ nature of happiness and of joy. And you'll have a new self-awareness. And you know what? You're going to like yourself. I decree that you are good-humored, even-tempered, pleasant. And I also decree that you like the new you. God bless you, my friend. I wish you pleasant, good-humored journeys.